Good morning with Entertainment City, I'm Jeremy John. Today we've got the new U2 album that, believe it or not, you may already own. I'll explain later. Plus we've got the latest groups to take a stand against uh, uh, singer CeeLo Green and football player Ray Rice. But we're going to start with Bieber. Yeah, it's Bieber again. He was on the runway at a fashion show and people started booing. So we started taking his clothes off. Yeah, yeah really he did and, and said it was actually grandma's idea. No, honestly, yes, he did. Justin was at Fashion Rocks. This is an annual international charity fundraiser event. Now, when he hit the stage, people started booing, so he started stripping. When he got down to just his Calvin Klein boxers, he asked the crowd, is this better? Bieber seemed okay with the whole stunt afterwards. Actually, he retweeted this vine that was made by a fan. Nice close up. Uh, he also tweeted a thank you to Fashion Rocks and Calvin Klein, and then jokingly, jokingly explained that uh, because of his onstage skin, it was due to grandma, saying, Grandma always said, kill him with kindness, and then strip on live national TV, LOL. Probably not what Grandma said, but for the record, this is not the first and probably not the last time we've seen Justin in his Calvin Klein underwear. It's long been rumored that he will soon be a model for the company. Next up, a double shot of scumbag. First up, Ray Rice, then CeeLo Green. Ray Rice is being dropped from the video game Madden 15. He is suspended indefinitely by the NFL after a vicious beating of his now wife. The makers of Madden, which is one of the most popular sports video games out there, say that he will be removed from the game by the end of the week. Number two is that guy, CeeLo Green. He's been dropped from yet another concert, this time a music festival in Alabama. They dropped CeeLo after he recently pleaded no contest to a felony charge of giving ecstasy to a woman without her knowledge and after several offensive tweets about sexual assault. CeeLo has had a number of concerts cancelled on him and TBS has cancelled his reality show. For Ray Rice, a restaurant in Baltimore will now give you a free pizza for your Ray Rice jersey. For the record, no one will ever give you anything for CeeLo Green's music. Finally, uh, the new YouTube album. It came out yesterday and you may already own it. Seriously, check your iTunes and look under purchased. It's okay, I got time, I'll wait. Okay, I can't wait anymore. Uh, yesterday, iTunes and YouTube surprised everybody by giving away 500 million copies of their new album. You're hearing it now. It's called Songs of Innocence. Now, Apple actually paid for the albums in a way. Word is there's a deal between Apple and YouTube worth about $100 million that includes the rights to the album and some marketing with the band. U2 and Apple have worked together in the past. You'll recognize this one. This is the band song Vertigo used in iPod commercials. Now this time the band actually performed live at the launch of the new iPhone. If you weren't one of the lucky half a billion people, you can get the album Songs of Innocence in the traditional way on October 14th. That's first look at your entertainment city on this Wednesday morning. Catch the second edition coming up just after 8. And be sure to follow the latest celebrity buzz on Twitter. You can tweet us at NCity. Entertainment City is brought to you in part by Cashmere Bathroom Tissue. Nothing feels like cashmere.